baby. Check these bad boys out. Whew. Welcome to my whip. Just a uh, change of scenery today for this video. Uh, but as you saw from the beginning, I think you know what it's about and probably know what I'm about to do. I don't know if you can see the bike on the back of the whip, but guess what? I got new shoes because I'm that guy that rode in vans that everybody tells you not to do, but I did. But that's just BMX days. All I ever rode in was vans. But everybody talked about, well, you need to get these uh, 510 shoes, and I was never heard of them, but uh, I don't know, I'm sure you guys have too, but I figured I'd uh, give you guys a little review. I'm about to go ride. I brought my vans, I'll have to show you, I'll get them out of the trunk. But supposedly these are the bee's knees. Uh, they feel pretty flexible. They remind me of like skate shoes, like old school like at knees and stuff like that. I can't believe I'm about to wear some old school skate shoes. I, it's all I used to wear back in high school. Or, well, sorry, like middle school, junior high. In high school, I got too cool. I was a loser and was all about Abercrombie and Hollister and you know, that phase. I'm older than you think. I but anyways, 510s. Uh, oh shit, look, they match my shirt. Look at that shit. Wasn't even planned, black and gold. Uh, these are size 10 and a half. I went with my regular size, so I'll let you guys know how that is. I wear a 10 and a half. I wear a 10 in some shoes, like Converse and actually Vans 10. And 10 and a half in like Nikes and Adidas. And I think these are actually owned by Adidas. I wanna see these bad boys. Uh, pretty stiff, not really too feeling too firm like the toe. Like it's got some nice bend in it. It's pretty easy to do. But this feels pretty hard because the bottom of my feet were killing. Just wait till you see my vans. And it was only five, I've only done five rides, six rides this year. They're trashed. Those, uh, those race face pedals kill you, kill your shoes. But all right, so let's put these on and uh, go shred. I'm over here at our uh, little local spot. Since it is a work week, I'm just coming out quick. It's like 5.30, it's only open till eight. And then we're gonna go do a big ride this weekend, so let's go give these a shot. Yo, we're back after that fun ride. So I went out there by myself and I met up with the dude who parked next to me and he had an e-bike and he wanted to ride with me. So I just had to do, we hit 13 miles at a trail here and he followed me on an e-bike. So that really kicked my ass. But I really want an e-bike now because he let me ride it and oh my god. Anyways, let's get back to those shoes. That's their warning to get the hell out of the trail because it's eight o'clock. Time to go. Guys, these shoes are like freaking glue. God, you can't see. Glue. I'm not even bullshitting. I'm not even trying to, I'm not like sponsored or anything, obviously. But these oh, are like freaking glue. I didn't have to think about my feet once when I started riding and I, I was going seven times as fast because I was following, or a dude was following me on an e-bike, so I was like, oh man, I gotta look like I'm freaking sweet. Uh, you guys, if you're riding in vans, let's just look at this, look at this. See that? See that chunk missing? See how it's like, that's six rides just gone. My feet were killing me. So yeah, um, sorry for the close up. Don't, just, just don't, actually, you know what, do it. See if you like it, but you're not gonna get a lot of rides out of it. Oh God, I'm getting sweat all over my car. It's freaking sick weather, dude. Yeah, but 510s, you guys, those are freaking rad. Uh, my feet didn't hurt. Like usually in those vans, like your foot like kind of goes over the pedal. Not really on those. They probably did, but you couldn't really feel it in those uh, 510s. I don't know, I'm just super impressed. I'm super exhausted. I feel like crap. But I'm trying to get better. I'm trying to get faster, so I'm kind of glad that dude uh, rode with me. I ended up getting his number. <laughs> it's like a, I got his number, that's funny. <laughs> so my review of the 510s, 10 out of 10. They should call them 10 out of 10. 10 10s, not 5 out of 10s. <laughs> wow. Anyways. It's worth spending a hundred bucks. Go get yourself some. You can probably find them on sale. Uh, REI usually has sales. I got mine on Amazon for a hundred bucks. They were here in four days. 
Wow, <laughs> driving and vlogging. It's not safe. Go ahead, get yourself some, do yourself a favor, get some 510s if you ride flats. It literally, I don't know what clipless pedals feel like, but I feel like that's what it would feel like. Like going over roots and just hitting rocks, like I was flying off. You should see this shinner I got. Hold on, you wanna see it? See that? <sighs> yeah. <laughs> it's terrible, it hurt like hell, and it just happened two days ago, because I was in my vans, and my feet kept flying off. Guess what, I didn't get any today. So, that's my simple, easy review. I'm a simple kind of guy. I'm gonna give simple reviews. I'm not gonna use big words, because I don't know any. And, appreciate you guys watching. I hope you guys get yourself some. Let me know if you have any questions. Let me know if you get some, and I hope it changes your riding game. You're gonna be so much faster. All right, peace out, keep cranking, later.